Hi, today we are going to learn P class and NP class. So, heading is P versus NP. <laughs> is there any competition between P and NP? Yes. There are so many problems where some in class P and some are in NP. Even there is a question where is P equal to NP or P not equal to NP? It is still open question. So what is P class problems? In a Turing machine, this class includes those languages which are recognized by some deterministic Turing machine in polynomial time. So if there is some deterministic Turing machine and that can solve a problem in polynomial time, that will go in P class. So what is NP class? Non-deterministic polynomial time. It includes those languages which are recognized by non-deterministic Turing machine in polynomial time. So in P class we use deterministic Turing machine for solving problem. Here we are using non-deterministic Turing machine. Uh, does it complicate it? Okay, let's take another definition. Any problem, decision problem, a decision problem is what? That answer can be given in yes or no. Any decision problem that can solve in polynomial time, that is P class problem. For example, if I have given a number and I said please find where it is odd or not. The algorithm you have used if you divide by 2, if it is divisible by 2, then it is even, otherwise it is odd. Yes or no answer can be given. Yes, a 5 for 5, it is odd. Yes, 6, no, it is not odd. If n is a number and you have to find where it is prime or not, there is some algorithm for that and through which you can find algorithm which will recognize that 53 is prime or not. It is divided by 1 or itself, then it is prime, otherwise not. So these are the problems can be solved in polynomial time. So that is B, P class problem. NP class, the class NP consists of all decision problems where yes can be verified. It's mean you can solve the problem. Yes, it is verified. So what is mean by verified? There is a certifier. It's mean there is another algorithm that will verify your problem is solved or not. So who is a certifier? And that will take polynomial time to solve this problem, to verify this problem. So example is like uh, NP class problem is sudo you have played 9 by 9 Sudoku problem okay it is also divided in three parts in this square all square will be filled nine cells would be in each square so solving a Sudoku is very tough task but verifying a solve Sudoku is easy. So that is a certifier. The moment someone solved the problem of Sudoku and now another person who will verify that you have solved correctly or not, that person is a certifier. So that can solve your solved problem in polynomial time, whether it is correct or not. Another example of NP class is like chess game. It is very difficult to say which move is good. In chess game, if two players are playing, it is very difficult to say which moves you will play and you will win the game. But in the last, it is easy to verify another person who is opposite side 
that you have played very well or not. For example, there is white and black. It moves some, like night it has moved. But is it best or it is correct that black will play another game through which it will verify that it is correct move or not. So this is NP class problem. Here is a diagram. If a problem can be solved in polynomial time or deterministic Turing machine, so that problem can also be solved in non-deterministic Turing machine. So this is the <coughs> difference between P and P class. Thank you.